Josh, absolutely phenomenal human being. Obviously, he's he's got certain conditions that put him at higher risk of developing a dependency. Josh is not just practicing alcoholic behavior. He has a full-blown dependency. I am an ex-alcoholic, and this, what he's doing, what he's saying, how he's acting, and the way he's responding is derivative and literally exact per definition of addicted to alcohol, man. Josh doesn't drink because he wants to. He drinks because he has to. He's openly admitted that in between drinks within an hour or so he has to have another shot or else this is the same exact thing to happen to me and i live the exact same way that josh did minus his public participation i i was an alcoholic in silence i was drinking 30 shots a day half of that bottle was by myself in my room in bed maybe watching a movie and the other half was at work as a dj partying with people and and taking shots and you know triples of patron and like all these crazy things man i know so Someone who has a full-blown addiction and struggling with dependency opposed to somebody who is practicing alcoholic behavior. Basically saying that if they continue practicing this type of behavior, they are raising the risk level of developing a dependency or becoming what some people will call an addict. What's most important to me is that we recognize the human beneath the condition. If you've got ADHD, if you've got autism, or you're on the spectrum at all, you are 10 times more likely to lean towards alcohol, to lean towards substances.